Hello everybody, welcome back to Court Farms. Court Farm Country Park, or whatever it's called. <laughs> I'm terrible with names. Um, I'm just finishing up this meadow. So swap back onto the control pad, there we go. Um, we've stacked all these pa um, bales manually, believe it or not. Manually? 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 I don't know how you say it. But yeah, it's gone, it's gone really well actually. I'm quite impressed with my um, bale stacking skills, I suppose. Is that a thing? I don't know if that's a thing or not, but it feels right, so I'm going to say it. Um, I've been thinking about this. I've put the seed buy point right on the farm, and I'm thinking I don't want to do that uh, long term because I want to put fertilizer in this shed on the left and seed around the corner. Keeping them separate, of course, as per Clarkson's farm rules, as what Cheerful Charlie told us about the chances of them mixing and setting fire. So we don't want that. Obviously, that wouldn't happen in the game, but I think just for realism, it's pretty cool. But we're going to eventually fill that up with seed and stuff. So, yeah. But right now, we're just going to stack these last two bales, jump in maybe the John Deere get some seed and start putting canola in the ground in the two fields boom well, that was a bit quick wasn't it in real life I think I might have decimated that pallet pretty cool though there we go just get lined up and scoop there we are this is the last one I was going to plough this and re-seed it, but I don't really want to at the moment. I want to get some money behind us first. Put this in the shed. Turn. Is that the last one? I think that was the last one. Yeah. I have to say. These two over here <laughs> were a lot of fun, these four were a lot of fun getting them in there I mean no rush to go back and do that again so we'll park this up out of the way we'll put it in the workshop shed there's plenty of room so we'll just put it here Got a nice tight turning circle. There we go. Now, which one are we in? Perfect. Of course, the Lamborghini is blocking the way, isn't it? Where is the Lamborghini? Well, dude, we'll just pull you up on the side here. Like that. I think this will be powerful enough to pull the plow, to pull the subsoda and cedar. And then we'll know in a minute in a moment, won't we? It's all one piece, is it? Lovely look at that. It's cool, it's got some weight on it though. How do I open the lid? Oh, it's a big cover. Hit that. Let's be sensible. I'm going to ignore that. Around here somewhere is the cedar. Oh. There it is. Ignore the green light in the background. That was me potentially going to sell some veils for money, but I cheated. So, well, not cheated, I just went, I went to the loan. We've got a loan. Ooh, hang on. That's not good. Try it again. You want canola, don't we? There you go. Ooh, that's close. You couldn't get any closer than that. Oh, no, that's not going to hit.
So we'll navigate this rather large bit of kit actually around. It's a tight yard. I do like it, it's alright when it's like this so. Can't rush. I'm going to move the trailers as well. I'll do that with the massive Ferguson once this guy's up and running. quick is it <laughs> it's really not quick what's the horsepower of this John Deere have I, have I got them the wrong way around 180 no so that is powerful that's probably the best one to put it on actually uh, what's the power harrow speed 7 miles an hour yeah we're not doing that are we Let's drop that off there. Let's put let's put the John Deere on. And of course by John Deere I meant Lamborghini. I can't believe I called it a John Deere. So I was looking at the John Deere. That's what it was. At least that's what I'm gonna go with anyway. Time to get this guy some proper field working, I think. Instead of just doing light work, grass work. Uh, why are you not connecting? Maybe it's because I'm in the wrong place. Lower. Yep. Much better. There we go. It's going to take a while. It's quite a big field, but it's, it's, you know, I'm not complaining. It's really good. I like it. So we can get in there, can we? Oh, okay, you can get in from over there. That's worth knowing. I'm still learning the map. It's quite a complex map. Which, you know, it's not bad. It's not a bad idea. I like the realism. When you first move to a place, you don't know it off by heart, do you? So. It should cover the whole corner. There we go. Yeah, I'm finally learning FS. Yeah, I, I am going to think about selling the seed pod thing and just having bags, but I need a. The problem is the farm is not that big and it's a lot of equipment to have. So. 
you know, I've got to be kind of mindful of what I'm buying and the size of stuff. But I mean, I suppose if we buy a, a bale trailer, it could double up, couldn't it, as a flatbed? Yeah, I suppose that would be the way to do it. to get the rabbits a water barrel trailer of some kind as well. Not just for the rabbits but for all the animals when we get them, because we are going to get them all, because it's going to take a while. Yeah, in fact, technically speaking, we are ready for cows pretty much, we just need a mixer wagon or a mixing station of some kind and um, silage, which we've, we've got, I'll show you where. Once we get this headland done. In fact, I'm going to get two, maybe three headlands done, and then I'll jump back with you. Actually, I don't know if, <laughs> if I unpaused it from the last jump. If I didn't, oh dear, if I did, yay. If I didn't, quick catch up. Yeah, we're basically just doing the headland on this. I just talked about the animals and getting them a water tanker uh, and where I'm going to do the silage from. That's pretty much it. I'm going to get this second headland done and I will definitely be back with you. I did two and a half times round. We're going to have to fill in that top corner, but that's fine. Uh, what was we doing next? I think we'll do a bit of mowing. Actually, we need to move some trailers. Um, need to move the trailer and the windrow out of here because this is where we're going to be putting the silage in the bigger pit it's quite difficult to maneuver this it doesn't have a very good turn when you pull it forward uh, reverse it back we'll see what I mean in a second You see, it doesn't it doesn't go very well. So we have to kind of start early with it. It's gonna go through the door. Yes. Put it. Get out of my shed, dear. Just run through the wall. Turn, just turn. That loot. We'll put the trailer next to it. Oh, crashed into a building. Is cramp tippers, they're really cool. Crampy cramp, are they cramp or crampy? I don't know. I just, I just like the look of them, I just think they're proper badass. I'll make it, yes. Let's get the mower hooked up and get head over to the meadow. There's the mower at the back. Of course this. Oh, 
can't see what I'm doing. Okay, game. If you say that will work, then that will work for me. I think we only stand up here. I'm going to go with we do. <laughs> I've got no idea if we do or not, but I think we do. I think we own this. Only one way to find out. Yeah, we do. Okay. Uh, why is it not dropping the swath? Huh. Do I own this land? Where are we? I do own it, so why am I not getting a swath? That's weird. Uh, I guess we just have to wait for the other field to grow back. It's a shame. Oh look, they're eating. <laughs> and they're playing. Oh, they're so cute. Hey little guy. How you doing? Oh, you're adorable. Look at your little ears twitching. Who else? Oh, you're having a little lay down, are you? Oh, you tired, buddy. You do stroke. Oh. I don't know what you're doing. You look a bit weird. Anymore? Oh, you was outside playing in the sunshine. How sweet. Oh, look at them. Oh, they're adorable. Fast. Jesus. Right, guys, I shall leave you to it. Don't step on them. You're a little piggy. You're still eating. Jesus. Now we've got some storage in here, I suppose. If we've got something small we can put in there. Yeah, I don't like that. It's a little bit not in keeping, is it? So, yeah. At the moment, I'm a bit stuck as what to do. So... Animal Bowser we can get. Can have that one, but it will make us quite skin. Oh, there's this one. How spare we are because we can, because it's really cheap. That's a bit red, isn't it? A bit too red. I think that's cool. I'll get that. Well, actually, oh, you're you're happy doing that. Yeah, there's that bit we've got to seed ourselves. You're happy there. You're happy in there. Let's bring you up out the field. I suppose we could drop this cultivator in with the rabbits, couldn't we? What do you think? I mean, it will not hurt them, will it? Shouldn't be in the way. What did it put in there? Which I don't know if it will. It's a bit of a squeeze. Crash. Oops. Let's plonk it down there and see what it looks like. I mean, it's a little bit in the way. Yeah, it's a little bit in the way. But you can see the bunnies from here. It won't affect their feeding, though. Let's go and find that trailer. Oh, and that's a wall. God, this is quite a chunky boy though. It looks better on this tractor than it does on the ones on Lincoln Farm. <laughs> it's more proportioned. But, uh, yeah. I'm not quite sure where we fill it up from. 
so that I don't know. We're going to have to find that out, I suppose. Um, there is a pond on the farm, so we'll have a look, see if we can um, access the pond. There we go, we'll go through the pigsty, that's quite tight. Is there another way? Can I make it through? Yeah, okay, we'll do that. We'll go around and come back on ourselves. And we'll see if we can fill this up with water from the pond. Sorry, I just hit the microphone. Let's see if we can just dip in the pond. Is that enough? Oh, we can. Nice. Well, that's good. I wonder if we can cut this grass, if it will show up as grass. Although, it's not a lot of grass, is it? Right, let's drive around the pond, I think will be best. A nice little area this is. What's that? Is that like an orchard? Does that lead anywhere? Or is it just its own little area? Oh, that's really nice. I like that. Yeah, I do like that. This tractor gets very heavy. This trailer gets very heavy. It takes a lot to stop it. I don't know what this fence is for here. I really don't. I wonder if we can... Oh, ah! I wonder if we can... Delete. No, that's a shame. That is a shame you can't change the farm layout so much as I'd like to get out of that hole. I was getting worried then. How much do they take? Oh, they take quite a little bit. 1500 litres. So now you guys should be okay for now. You've got water. You've got grass. Saying health is zero, but they haven't been in there very long, really. Um, we'll put this at the side of the house. Not a bad little place there for a shed, actually. Right, that's that taken care of. Um, I wonder if we can mow the sheep pasture. It's not very long, so we shall see. No. Okay. Well, that's the end of that then. <laughs> um, yeah, that area looks like it needs to grow. And that definitely looks like a spawn point for the pallets. This is a nice little area. I do like this. This is cool. Oh well. 
Well, I guess really that's all we've got time for today then, because there's nothing more else I can really do. Um, I think I'll get the other field seeded off screen. Um, and then next time you see this farm, it'll be harvest day, I suppose. So we can't really do much else. <laughs> I mean, it's not a problem, but uh, I'm a bit concerned about why this mower's not quitting the grass. I'll tell you what we could make a start on before I do end the video. Again, I can't seed it yet, I don't think, So after these guys have done the fields. But let's dig that up, that meadow up. Let's make it into a... Well, that'll do. Yeah, let's make it into um, a proper... proper meadow I think I'll probably save that for next time actually um, yeah that'll be the next video I think we'll do that there we go how is our cedar doing he's doing quite a good job actually I think he's gonna get through yeah I think I'm just gonna leave him to it I've got some chores to do around the house so I'll leave him to do that while I get on and do the tidying up and washing up and whatnot well, thank you so much for watching, guys. Take care. See you in the next one. Bye for now.